and we back it's Vach Lombardi we're here with a cowboy video um this is the time of year where I really get into the cowboy bag in terms of evaluating last season performances there's a lot of debates and transgressions online and this is where I kind of take film and break down the happenings and the discussions so expect a Dak Prescott should get paid video at some point to really debate and drive that point home but today we're going to talk about Amari Cooper but before we get started I want to shout out to all my Patreon people um, we're giving away a lot of free merch so just go ahead and sign up today we're giving away to all tiers um, I need to send Dylon and stuff if, if he hit me up with an address I'm waiting on him um, I've sent the emails out to the winners for this month we also going to give um, T. Ross some merch because he showed a lot of love in the um, in the live stream the other day and the handful of people that drop super chats to to help get the new soundboard for the um for the setup or whatnot you know i'm gonna put y'all in a little situation to uh you know draw y'all for some merch as well so we give away a lot of merch man so uh sub to the patreon man it's only a dollar if that's what you want to do man i appreciate y'all but let's get into this amari cooper thing right I had to come up with the uh the criteria so to speak of what we call in a drop from Amari Cooper. So I typed in Dak to Amari Cooper um, incomplete passes, right? And I went through all the incomplete passes. And of course, some were uh, bad throws by Dak. It wasn't crazy, crazy the amount of them, but um, um, some were bad throws. Uh, we had some that were good coverage by the by the uh, DB. We're not going to add those, but I did have some that I had a tough time with. Right? How do we judge passes that um, that kind of touch Coop in the hands, but you know they weren't considered accurate passes? Take a look at this. Right. Coop is up top and chat box. This is a good time for me and you to have a discussion. I'll be in the chat box for like 48 hours talking about this one, right? If you're Amari Cooper here and the pass is kind of low and you got to squat down to get it. Yes, you're a professional and it kind of hits your hand. So you should be rallying this catch in, but I had a tough time with this. I didn't know where to put it. What I wanted my, kind of rule for a drop to be was if um the route was good we got separation the pass was on point hit the hands but we just didn't come down with it that's what i think i wanted my drop uh you know rules or criteria to be but chat box what do y'all think about this about this pass here right it's kind of low coop kind of got a cook he kind of got to go down to get it like what's the vibes on this let me see if i can get a better view from the cartel view you know, so so it's behind them and it's low. So tell me what y'all think about those. Let me give y'all two more examples of passes that I thought were kind of too tough to call. There's these passes here where like Dak really got to, you know, lead lead Cooper going forward and all that. And so should, should we count this right? And Coop kind of does a a solid job corralling it. He just didn't come down with it. Now, yes, that's an incomplete pass, but by technic technical rules, that's a drop for Coop. Do y'all consider that a drop? I don't know. I think if you got to dive and go out, I mean, sure, you should have caught it, right? But in terms of we're talking about, we're going to admonish you and 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 wave our finger and fuss at you for dropping passes. Should this be uh, considered us fussing at Coop in terms of dropping passes? Um, I got another one, too. Hold on. We got the New England Patriots. Um, same deal, right? <laughs> the pass is kind of in front of them. Plus, we in a damn hurricane, right? Do are we adding are we adding weather implications here? Um, and and then Coop barely dropped this. One. It was just one of those instant replay. I bobbled it. It kind of touched the ground. People are calling this a drop, but what do y'all think? Chat box, let me know. These these are the ones I had a hard time with. Um, now I have one, two, three, four, five drops that I thought were egregious. Five drops that I thought were flat out disrespectful. Five drops that we need to fix if we're gonna go to the promised land next year check him out we got coop lined up in the slide up here let's take a look and see what happens here he's up top right here so this is what i mean by my criteria right um he gets off the line well creates separation boom pretty good route right there right and he is open and the ball gets to him and it hits him but it falls right now the pass ain't perfect here but every pass can't be perfect so let's just you know <laughs> let's just consider all that right you would prefer coop to not have to stop and come down and try to um, pick it up or whatever but i do consider this a drop because i do think it's catchable and of course the, all this is quasi subjective or whatever but take a look at this um coop's in the inside again right here um and i think this is gonna go over his head but he's gonna yeah so so this is a drop for me this is flat out egregious this ain't no conversation here this this six 
It ain't six, but <laughs> but the ball is 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 placed well. The separation is good. You get in front of your defender. The ball hits your hands. We just couldn't come down with it. So that's drop number two. It really ain't much conversation to be had here. But um, boy, that was that was uh, that's a that's a big game. And what's what's the down the distance on this, man? Because I know we talking about you know there are some cowboy haters that's calling Dak terrible and we shouldn't pay him. And this was third down so this would have been a first down and you know how you know how easy Dak would have broke Tony record if all the drops that the Cowboys got weren't drops I think PFF ugh, PFF got us down for like 48 drops or something like that's 43 drops or whatever that's that's ridiculous but moving on the YouTube Illuminati is taking money away from your favorite content creators, and people often ask the best way to support the channel directly. I tell them that subscribing on my Patreon. Just $1 a month would increase production and the frequency of uploads. Basically, that means more content for you. For less than a bag of almond M&Ms, you can support the channel, call dibs on requests for future videos, and you can have access to Patreon-exclusive material like my throwback film sessions. That's patreon.com slash Vach Lombardi. I appreciate the support. Doski Woski. Salute. What about this? Coop at the top of your screen here. Take a look at him. Let's see what happens here. Separation. Boom, boom, boom. Come back. Hit him in the hands. Ball on the ground. I think that's 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 pretty clear. There would would still love your opinion, but I don't think we we I don't think we're gonna get much um, debate out of that one. Uh, let's just move on. Yeah, buddy. This one's uh this one's in Miami. He's in the slot right here to the bottom of your screen on the inside, and he's gonna he's gonna hear these footsteps here. That's a focus drop there, buddy. That's absolutely a focus drop. I think this is clear. Um, no debating here. Probably should have brought that one down. That one's ugly, man. That one's ugly. I see most of Cooper's real drops came from the beginning portion of the season. And all of his drops that I kind of had debates with came from the, the end of the season. I think that's that's kind of interesting here. Um, here we go. Once again, Cooper in the slot. Down bottom. Following my mouse here. Going over the middle. Just off the hands, right? Just off the hands. Um, Dak kind of put a little mustard on this one. Damn, Dak threw the hell out. <laughs> Boy, it's fire coming off that mud. And you know, but but you know, I think that one that one should be uh, should be caught. Let's take a look at cartel view. See if we can get uh, if we can get anything from the cartel view. Nope, hit him in the hand. So. Yep, that's it there. Now, of course, you guys can do your own research and come up with your own conclusions. Absolutely. Um, but this this is my independent research. This is what I got from it. I got I got Amari Cooper down for five egregious drops. And the first four I showed you, I kind of had a rough time with them. Uh, the rest of the incompletions that Dak had to Amari Cooper were like overthrows or just good defensive play. Um, so I'm not counting those. But, um, hey, if y'all disagree... Hey, make a video or something. I don't care. <laughs> I'll watch it. Tag me to it. Um, anyway, though, man, I'm Vach Lombardi, V-O-C-H-L-O-N-B-A-R-D-I. Don't forget about my Patreon people. We give away a lot of merch. Don't you miss out on that. Um, follow me on Twitter, V-O-C-H-L-O-N-B-A-R-D-I. Y'all hold it down for the Doski, Woski, and the Peaski, Whiskey, man. Salute.